school year, it was all about getting students back in person. Well, now Baltimore County families are fighting for the opportunity to keep their kids home virtually with classes beginning in less than a month to go. And WMAR 2 News' Abby Isaacs explains why the county school system cannot accept any more students online. Baltimore County Schools says the deadline has passed and they cannot accommodate any more students virtually. But families are asking for flexibility as COVID cases rise and students battle anxiety with returning in person. It frightens us and um, it frightens my kids. Dundalk mom Don Lee is worried about her kids moving in person in the fall. I don't want to send my child to school because of the new cases rising every day and the new um, Delta. They unknowingly missed the deadline for the Baltimore County Public Schools virtual learning program, and now it's too late. And I just feel like with the COVID cases rising and um, that we're not the only parents going to, you know, struggle with this. That includes Parkville grandmother Vicki Barnes, but it's not because of physical health. It's because of her 16 year old grandson's mental health. He's on an IEP and excelled during virtual learning last school year. She initially didn't enroll him for the fall because she was worried about the social aspects of the 11th grade that he would miss. But as the date, you know, slowly approaches for turning in, returning in person, his anxiety is, is rising. And he stated that he receives more help remaining virtually than returning in person. When she tried to enroll him after the deadline, she got the same response from Baltimore County Public Schools as Dawn. They can't take any more students. It's a child's education here that is, that's at stake. The BCPS spokesman said they extended the enrollment deadline for the virtual learning program from May to July to be responsive to student needs, saying, quote, this second deadline was necessary to implement and enforce for planning and staffing purposes. As such, we're no longer accepting enrollments at this time, end quote. I understand completely that they need a, a, a deadline to get the staff and, you know, things set up for these children when they do return virtually. But on the other hand, there is time. We're talking what, maybe four weeks before the start of school. There's time. BCPS says 3,400 students are enrolled online this fall. And after they announced the universal masking requirement in schools last week, they saw an increase in the number of families reaching out to go virtual. Where's the flexibility in this? There has to be some flexibility on the part of Baltimore County Public Schools. Tuesday morning, the Baltimore County Board of Education is holding a special virtual meeting to update the community on universal masking inside schools. In Towson, Abby Isaacs, WMAR 2 News.